Hello everyone, this is Miss Natalie, your history teacher. I hope you are doing well, safe and sound. In this tutorial, I'll discuss the material included for week number 18. Um, so let's start with the first day of this week, which is the last week of the year, the 26th. Um, now on this day, we are going to continue tackling lesson uh, number 8.4, the Ottoman Empire and the Safavid Empires. On this day, you are going to use um, the notes that um, that you gathered um, in the previous lesson um, and build a PPT in groups. Um, you can use the tutorials as aiding um, resources along with the PPT on this page. Um, if you scroll down to interactive activity number one, it's a reminder for you that uh, with the assigned topics for each group. So make sure that you work efficiently. And also you have the interactive activity number two, which includes the ideas and essential information for each and every group. Now on the following day is the presentation day. Um, each group will present for about, let's say 15 minutes, up to 17 minutes about their assigned topic or topics. Um, so make sure that you are ready to present on the 28th and the 29th, we are going to deal with the case studies. Um, um, so I did not choose the case study for you. We will be um, choosing the case study in class. We're gonna, disc we're gonna choose one of the, the case study topics and then work on them. And on the following day, there will be the debate topic uh, about the gathered information um, regarding the case studies that we chose. Now on the last day of this week, which is the 30th, we are going to have a debate class about uh, titled, Do the Vikings Deserve Their Bad Reputation? It's, I think it's a very interesting topic to actually discuss and to have a debate about. Um, on the BC page, we're gonna find a tutorial about the Vikings please watch it prior to the class so you would have an idea about the Vikings. And interactive activity number two includes the layout of the debate class. Thank you so much for listening and have a nice day.